growth and development meaning concept and principles meaning growth growth refers to physical increase in some quantity over time it includes changes in terms of height weight body proportions and general physical appearance development an event constituting a new stage in a changing situation growth definitions in increase in size or the amount of an entity encyclopedia britannica changes in size in proportion disappearance of old features and acquisition of new ones harlock growth refers to structural and physiological changes crow and crow growth concept growth refers to physiological changes changes in the quantitative respect in terms of growth growth does not continue throughout life growth stops after maturation growth occurs due to the multiplication of cells growth is cellular growth is one of the part of the developmental process growth may be referred to describe the changes in particular aspects of the body and behavior of the organism the changes produced by growth are subjects of measurements they may be quantified and observable in nature growth may or may not bring development development concept development refers to overall changes in the individual it involves changes in an orderly and coherent type towards the goal of maturity development changes in the quality along with quantitative aspect development continues throughout life development is progressive development occurs due to both maturation and inter- interaction with the environment development is organizational development is a wider and comprehensive term development describes the changes in the organism as a whole development brings quantitative changes which are difficult to measure directly they are assessed through keen observation of behavior in different situations development is possible without growth principles of human development there are several basic principles that characterized the pattern and the process of growth and development even though there are individual differences in children's personalities attitudes behavior and timing of development the principles and characteristics of development or universal pattern it involves change there are different types of change occur such as changes in size proportions disappearance of old features and acquisition of new features it is a continuous process development continues throughout the life of an individual this process takes place in interaction with the environment in which a person lives one stage of development is the basic framework for the next stage of development a child has limited knowledge and experiences about his environment it follows a direction and uniform pattern in an orderly manner development process from the center of the body onward the child's arms develop before the hands and the hands and feet develop before the fingers and toes development proceeds from the head downwards the child gains control of the head first then the arms and then the legs individual differences in the development process even though the pattern of development is uh, similar for all children but the rate of development varies among children each children develops as per his abilities and perception of his environment children differ from each other both genetically and environment it depends on maturation and learning changes in the brain and nervous system account largely for maturation these changes in the brain and nervous system account largely for maturation the child's environment and the learning that occurs as a result of the child's experiences largely determined whether the child will reach optimal development it is predictable 
specific area of development such as different aspects of motor development emotional behavior speech social behavior concept development goals intellectual development etc follow predictable patterns for example the growth of the children in height and weight etc continue up to a certain age early development is more critical than later development it negative experiences occur during the early life of the child the more adjustments may take place clock concludes that delinquents can be identified as early as 2 to 3 years of age different researchers view that preschool years age or most important years of development as basic foundation is laid down during this period which is difficult to change it involves social expectations in every society there are certain rules standards and traditions which everyone is expected to follow children learn customs traditions and values of the society they realize from the approval or disapproval of their behavior it is potential hazards hazards may be of physical emotion and sorry environmental or psychological type the growth of the child may be retarded he may be an aggressive person or he may encounter adjustment problems for example if a child is slurring or stammering and parents neglect the child the child may continue with this problem happiness varies at different periods of development happiness varies at different periods in the developmental process childhood is the happiest period of life and puberty is the most unhappy the patterns of happiness vary from child to child and it is influenced by the rearing process of the child 